and welcome back to 500 days of positivity day 185 it is the 29th of the 9th 2014 and it's a monday i just want to start by saying thank you all so much for your kind comments and your kind words on friday's day of positivity video you are all so wonderful and i do appreciate all your support and your awesomeness so thank you so much for that so the second thing before we start is that there was a comment on Friday's video about the vinyls behind me so I just thought I would tell you guys what vinyls are behind me. Basically last week we found and we stumbled upon this amazing vinyl shop and they were so cheap, the vinyls there were so cheap, they were £2 per vinyl which is really really good, normally they're about £5-10 each so as soon as I went in there I was like oh my gosh I need to get some things and the ones that I chose are all from musicals because I do love a good musical and they are Sound of Music, The Little Shop of Horrors, Grease and Saturday Night Fever and actually my record player is right here and the record player I got was from Urban Outfitters and it's a really nice blue one and the best thing about it is that it's portable which is fantastic it closes up and it has like a handle on it as well so that's awesome and I really excited about starting a vinyl collection I think it's really cool and especially with these songs and this kind of music listening to the quality of the song through vinyl there's just something about it that just fits and it's perfect especially the sound of music I don't know there's something about the hymns in the churches and that kind of thing through a vinyl player that just really resonates with you and we were listening to a few tracks during the beginning and just falling asleep because it was so soothing and just like so those are my vinyls. I hope to get a few more over the next few months and I will give you guys an update if I do and when I do. So on to today's positive. Today's positive, there's a few things. The first is that, as I said yesterday over on Twitter and Facebook, today marks the first day of my two weeks of holiday, which I'm so excited about. It's the first kind of extended time that I've had off from work since I started work, which was nine months ago. So it's been been a long time since I've had a long holiday and I'm just so excited. I've got lots of things planned that I really want to do, creative things, videos. I mean it mainly centres around YouTube but I love that and I'm very excited and that leads me on to my second positive, new supplies which I'm really excited about. I've been running out of sketchbooks especially watercolour sketchbooks and that's why I haven't been doing lots of coffee with paintings because I just haven't had the paper and the shops that I usually go to are so expensive when it comes to watercolour paper that I just kind of wanted to hold out a little more and just see if there were any other shops that did them for a much better price and so I decided to hop on a train and go to a town nearby where they have a massive craft and art shop called Hobbycraft and oh my gosh this place is amazing it has everything and anything you could ever need and they were having sales and three for twos which is what I got my sketchbooks on so I thought I would share the sketchbooks that I got today with you guys the first one is a nice little small one from De La Rowney it's spiral bound which I do prefer spiral bound simply because one you can have things flat at all times and when you turn the page or if you want to draw on the back you don't have that bit that comes up in the middle and it just warps things so I really like that and this this is just a smooth cartridge paper so kind of just good for sketching and charcoal and pen that kind of thing and it's A5 so I got a little wee one I think this is the one that came free because this was on three for two the second sketchbook I got I was so excited to see this sketchbook or this brand of sketchbook I always get but I've never seen spiral bound and as soon as I saw the spiral bound I'm like Yes, I must get that sketchbook. And it's this one here. Again, it's De La Rowney. It's a black cover and I really like this sketchbook because the paper is a little bit more heavyweight and it's just got a little more texture and grain to it so you could do a little bit more so I've done watercolour and things on this kind of paper and it's not the best for watercolour but you can do more things with it and you can use more mediums on it so I really like it and I like it for sketching as well. I think I am going to decorate the front a little bit differently 
because black is a little bit boring so I may do that in a video or may not we'll just have to see but that is the second one I got oh yes and this one is A4 so I got an A5 an A4 and then the third one I got is a big one it's an A3 and this one actually I saw this at the last moment I was gonna get um, a specific watercolor pad which had about 12 pages in it and then I saw this one and this one says that it's mixed media and you can do everything from pastels to acrylic to watercolor everything like that the paper is really heavyweight so it can take a lot of things and it's not got too much grain because I find that when I paint with coffee and there's too much graininess and texture to the paper you can't be precise so I prefer a little bit of texture to get the coffee and allow it to really sit well and have that kind of really nice look to it but not too textury as to kind of distort the picture so this was perfect and it was only two pounds more than the other one and it comes with 30 sheets so I was really really happy about this purchase overall I'm very happy with my three for two sketch pads and then of course at the till they always had those little little pieces and bits and bobs which are like 50p or a pound and they get me they always get me and the little bits that were on the till today were these cute 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 little notebooks like this so tiny and so wee but so cute Cute. I just I just had to get one and I really liked this one because it says dance as though no one is watching you sing as though no one can hear you live with no excuses love with no regrets laugh until your body aches and dream big and I think that is beautiful and even if I never use this notepad which could definitely be a possibility I just think it's uber cute and it was 50p so made me happy today. So those are my positives of the day. It's a little bit of a grey day outside but that is not going to taint my positivity and optimism today. I'm working on quite a few things, one of which is the hashtag Shake It Off collab project. Stay tuned for that. As always, I'd love you guys to leave me your positives of the day in the comments down below or you can leave them via Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. All the links to my social media will be on the screen and in the description box down below. Or you can head over to my website and leave your positive on the Spread the Positivity page which I will also leave a link of in the description box down below. I wish you guys a wonderful Monday. Don't forget that on all other days that I don't post on this channel, I will be posting positives over over on my Twitter, Facebook and Instagram so you guys can join me over there to keep the positivity going and yes, let's end today with a daily jig and I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Bye!